That man is in jail tonight, charged with raping a 14-year-old girl. And how the two met could lead to a tough talk with your own children tonight. Police say Michael Baggert Jr. contacted his victim through a chat app. It's free, and you can download it to your smartphone. Detectives say Baggert was posing as a 16-year-old, but he's really 20. Police say he met the victim in Yorktown, where she lives, and that the assault happened near her home. Then on your side's Aaron Kelly talked to the lead investigator in the case. Aaron, let's start with the name of the app so parents know what to look for. Well, it's called Kick, and we were able to easily download it on our phone. And it is here where investigators say a 20 year old man posed as a 16 year old man, and that led to a meeting with a 14 year old girl, and they say that that man raped her. I'm proud of her that she came forward and was able to give this information. It cannot be easy. The York Pocosin Sheriff's Office says a 14 year old girl came in with her family Sunday to report a man had raped her back in August. She said she met him on a social networking phone app called Kick. He originally portrayed himself as 16 years old, and uh, within a small time frame of meeting her on Kick, he came to the area where she lived and um, they walked around. Investigators say the man is 20 year old Michael John Baggert Jr. of Virginia Beach and that he took the victim into the woods off of Dorothy Drive in Yorktown. No one answered the door at Baggert's home on Berrywood Road. The stranger who's preying on these kids in this day and time isn't just the guy that's on the street, you know, offering candy, trying to pick them up. It's a whole different grooming process, this electronic grooming of children. Anyone can download the app on their phones, but it does ask you to verify that you're 17. Lieutenant Dennis Ivey says he sees more crimes happening online, and parents can play a key role in keeping predators away. Check their text messages, check where they've been online, uh, check the home computer, you know, make sure if they have social media, you have the passwords to it. Now, we did check with Kick, the phone app company, but did not hear back. Investigators say they are right now checking to see if there are any more victims in this case. Live in York County, Aaron Kelly, 10 on your side.